Happy ending. We only needed a crazy sister to come and abuse her little sister and simp for cry and everything was fine. The craziest thing about, you know, um, that new girl, I forget her name, I'm sorry. It's that she, as a child, she was given that relic, which kind of threw her balance off, which forced her to just like master her movement. And then on top of that, they're all blindfolded. The masks, because it didn't have any holes, they were forced to learn how to just fight without vision. They rely on their keen senses. This girl is literally moving so fast that she caught all the bullets, lined them up on the ground, and even did a cool pose while being blind. It's unreal. The way that Liz treats her sister is fucked up, but the whole point of this is like, you know, it's about absolute devotion to cry and, you know, you're supposed to be master servant and I'm disappointed that this is the best you could do. Honestly, pretty fucked up even if that's just justified. It's pretty twisted. Now, there is the slime thing that I'm seeing in the intro section right now. The slime relic thing was supposed to be banned a long time ago by the Empire or some shit, right? Yet when we opened it, nothing was there. Does that mean it's already gone somewhere else? I got no clue. Maybe this leads into the next arc. Let's begin today's reaction. Here it is again. Who's this pink hair girl? Stri. It's literally called Stri Slime. She's a hunter level 2. She, a level 2, created a slime that's so dangerous that the Empire banned it? Alchemist. Alchemist. Got it. I mean, she's a Strange Grief member. Yeah. I mean, even if she's level 2. Her brains. Okay. So what does the slime really do? Wait, 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 what was that? What was that? You made the slime. How imaginative. Oh, she's just fucking insulting Loki. <laughs> the fuck? Just a bit dangerous? It'll destroy the entire capital. And we don't know where the fuck it is. We opened that shit. We don't know where it is right now. <laughs> hmm. About that. Tokiwa Oh shit, you're This is still the opening. Fuck off. Where's the slime, bro? Where is it? That's just gonna show up. It's probably been released and it's probably like causing havoc in like a different country right now. Is it gonna look like Rimuru? Mm, it was already gone. So it's in the safe then. I mean, that's. You could assume that for sure. That could definitely be possible. I think you're coping though. <laughs> he's, he's coping. Exactly. <laughs> Oh. Phantoms are getting stronger. Is this literally not the wolf den that we were in? I mean, we did open it in here. <laughs> Maybe it's in here somewhere, and this part is about to find the slime right now. Yeah, bro's trying to convince himself that it's, you know, it was never in there. He's guilty as fuck. Uh -oh. Training. Mm. I think Tino's about to get shit on even more. You know. You know, maybe there was a large-scale annihilation of a country or a kingdom? Just in case? I don't know. I don't know about that, man. 
あとはよろしくバイバイ地震といった天才かだるまで何の前触れもない事件 Oh shut the fuck up this glaze Oh my god Christ 様 is so amazing He's constantly looking out for what could be happening He's predicting 10 steps into the future Oh さすが Christ 様偶然と言えるかもしれないけど二度三度と続けば You're certain? Yeah, he does keep just predicting things that's bad that's gonna happen. Because he himself fucked up, and then he goes tries to solve it. But to her, she thinks that he is this prophet. He just see. He sees everything in the future. <laughs> What's happening? Is this the basement? Yo. Level Uh-oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh もう限界なのバカにしてるの殺さないと思ってるの殺すよ大事なものはないの<笑> This bitch is crazy! I don't care about the master-servant relationship! The apprentice trying to look over for Krai! This is insane, bro! You're terrible! 殺さないと思ってるの殺すよ大事なものはまだ動かない The way she twists the words! Honestly, the way that she twists the words right now to like fit to her like are, are you insulting me right now? You're not getting up? I, I think this is straight up some regular shit from ReZero. The way that she's able to just like justify and reason why Tino is not getting up and somehow it's like an insult to her. Can I please? And switch. You're about to kill her. That was an aggressive fucking angle. God damn. From behind, you can see the moons here. You don't get it? Cause she didn't train like you, you crazy bitch! Give her the relic when you were her age, bro! G -g Give her the fucking mask! And I bet that Tina would also be that good. <laughs> I, I, I guess Liz is just so stupid that she doesn't understand how powerful she is. None of them, I mean, they are stupid. They gotta be retarded, right? If they're fucking literally glazing cry and saying, oh my god, you're this amazing person. They are all delusional. They got the craziest fucking start. Their training is insane. And they think that that was normal. And now she projects that standard onto her little sister. It's just unreasonable. Okay. <laughs> she's gonna fucking blow i was worried because usually liz like immediately switches her tone when cry is here but she didn't she was pretty hostile but there it is oh oh, oh. i ain't done yet oh shit she was training with the mask on she couldn't even see anything and she was getting bodied by liz come in Did you just leave? That's fucked up. You let her go? You close the door and let the abuse continue? Cry, what the fuck? That's messed up. No, there is something you can do. Liz clearly listens to Cry. I bet that if Cry fucking pushed on a bit, that Liz would have folded. Dude, this is not funny. This is actually fucked up. I don't care if Tino wants to continue. I love how you can still hear them grunting and like, you know, shouting in the background all you can like, you know, listen to the dialogue. Tino may be dead at this moment. Bald. 
It sounds like he should be the clan leader instead. Where is he? <laughs> it definitely is. You fucked something up. The phantoms are getting stronger. Did, did the slime do something? I'm not sure. Is this gonna be another issue? Basically, Gark is Tino last arc. And this party is the party we had last arc. And it's another situation where Cry fucks up and he's like, ah, I don't want to deal with it. Y'all do it. Then later on, he's like, oh no, <laughs> what have I done? I gotta go save them. And then the secretary will be like, oh, you are such a good person taking the busy schedule out of your day to save them. Oh, and then the other party's gonna be like, yo, can we do this? And Gark is gonna be like, master's orders are absolute. Master is coming. This is, there's a, this plans within plans, bro. What are you Nothing. This guy's asking all the great questions. <laughs> this is the voice of reason right now. Yeah, good old cry. Yeah, he knows what he's doing. No, no, no. Everyone else is just so deluded because they've been here for so long. And then you guys like calling out the bullshit. Like, yo, something is off, man. Something feels very weird. What? Yeah, he's a monster in his own way. If you think about sending innocent people to their death and almost letting them die and then just barely making it in and clutching. Alright. <laughs> if only they knew. Balls. Blame Cry. Blame the slime. Bruh. Yeah, he doesn't fucking go out to different treasure vaults, no different dungeons, because he's probably too scared and he just doesn't want to. Bruh. Bruh. Oh, what is this guy? Huh? Explorers Association, is this, this this new antagonist? They have some sort of symbol on their back. Grandmaster of Mages, the head of research in capitals. But are we about to accidentally foil these guys' plans without even being aware that they exist? Mage clan, okay. Well, like, straight up, Krai's fuck up is somehow going to unfold the secrets of the Akashic Mage Evil People Research Group. I think that's what's happening. But this has nothing to do with the slime, right? I don't think anything slime about this. Damn. Wait a minute. Creating treasure vaults on whim sounds kind of beneficial for society, does it not? Isn't that a good, is that a bad thing or a good thing? I don't know enough of the mechanics of this world, right? Like the whole aspect of like how the wolves even turn into phantoms and shit, that's a little still beyond me, but like this on a brief glance sounds kind of good, but I bet there's some bad side effects from it. Sophia. What the fuck is this guy's decide? <laughs> Looking like a chipmunk, but Sophia is an important character to make note of. Who is Sophia? Sophia Black. Sounds very important. Alright. So, just brief summary. There's this evil group of magicians doing a research, and that's why the ley lines aren't changing in the wolf dungeon, and that's why it's stuff, stuff are still going wrong. If they complete their research, they can create treasure vaults on a whim, and somehow, some way, due to Cry's fuck ups, we're going to uncover the secret org and save the day, I guess. Oh, there's a slime. Okay, this is a slime. Yeah, now this. Maybe it's a dream. 
I'm gonna call that this is a uh, Krai's nightmare. There's no way it just happens right now. Unless it is happening in like a different continent. <laughs> Maybe this is what Krai is like dreaming of like, oh shit, nightmare. There's no way this is actually happening right now. It's just guilt, right? Wake up. Got him. Bro, the kilt is eating him up. We sleep together? Is Tino here too? Yo. You did say hot. She's like an oven. That's kind of nice of her, I guess. I didn't think that she would ever care about, you know, how Tino's really feeling. I think it's just for the date. She just wants to go with the date. Date episode? <laughs> That's a funny symbol. This looks like just like a foot, right? Toes. It's a whole ass soul of a feet. We're going on a date. Go away, Baldi. That's right. Diapers. Diapers. Is he that strong to talk back? Okay, okay. I mean, I don't think that's really indicative of the overall strength, but he blocked that kick pretty easily, so I'm gonna think that he's pretty strong. Look at that aura. Show me the fight! Don't off-screen it! It's a cute parfait. You can still hear Liz in the background. Just like Liz and Tino continues to train while we're outside talking, we can still hear Liz. I appreciate that, that they're, you know, continuing the stuff that we've seen behind the scenes. <laughs> but if you don't tell, it's not gonna get resolved. Are we gonna secretly handle it? I feel like because we were traveling so fast into the wolf dungeon with that, you know, cape relic flying thing, and maybe the slime did get opened up in the wolf den without us knowing it, right? Because, like, think about it. It was either in the vault, and we've never opened it in the vault, and that's why he was coping and thinking, oh, it must have never been in the, you know, the, uh, the, the fucking container. Or it did somehow get released while he was too busy flying. And my theory is that Slime will somehow uncover the Akashic Mage Clan shit and things will just solve itself. I don't know. Maybe the Slime will be the final boss, but uh, I feel like it's in there right now. Oh, wow, they're still fighting. Jesus. He's dead. I mean, he's huge. So, like, right now, he's even nerfed. He's doing too much, you know, like, death jobs. He used to be way stronger. He got a corrector. Yo, corrector! Level 7. War demon. Yo, this poor building. Who's gonna fucking pay for all this shit? That switch up, bro. When did she change back? Wait, wait, wait. Was she wor- I'm like, was she so fast that she literally changed the outfits? No, no, no. She's always been wearing a skirt and a blazer jacket thing, but her legs are all like kind of- the thighs are open. 
And here now, no, 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 she's doing the same thing. I was like, did she just change her outfit entirely because she's so fast? No, 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 no. Uh -huh. Baldi's pretty strong though. War demon. <laughs> Even her glass is shattered. It's just that you're a monster. She was doing a level 7 vault, right? Some sort of exploration? Is the implication here that the level 7 vault that she cleared it was so weak that she just beat the boss, or is she saying that the wolf den was so unmemorable that she didn't even know there was a boss there? Either or, she basically cleared out the trash so hard, she didn't even think it was a boss. Yeah, the wolf den, I think, right here. Sri and the others are at the night palace. Every other strange grief members are still at this treasure vault. Okay. They're slowly like introducing them one by one. Yeah, it's a big problem. Let's run away from our problems. Yeah. <laughs> I need to learn from her? If this entire place dies, what should we do? We should just get out of here. Let's run away, bro. Fuck this place. I don't want to save him. Oh, whoa. That was fast. Was there pickpocketing happening? That's it? Just staring? He's just looking at you and he's like, no, you're not fucking looking at us. I feel bad for that guy, man. This is a monster. You're allowing him? How dare you? Look at Master. Okay. Oh, shut the fuck up. Oh my god. <laughs> How did he know? I, they, they call me and he's so oh my god, he just knows bro, he just knows. And, and now he's gonna get in his plan. Why why would why would a thousand tricks let me go? Is this a warning? That he's aware that at any moment that he could end me? Oh my god. Slime will be fine. Thank you, narrator. Post credit scene. Okay, Akashic. Akashic mages. Hmm. This is not a grief member, is it? That's the right hand girl of the Akashic mage guy, but this is not the. How do you not remember Sophia Black? That, do you, maybe this is in the past before he met her. This is probably in the past. Yeah. This crimson red hair. She should be Sophia Red. She's scary. She's scary. Yeah, she's fucking crazy. I think she's a real problem. Is she a character that we've seen before? And this is not a strange grief member, right? I do not remember a long red haired girl. No, there isn't, right? So, Sophia Black was the girl that the guy was kind of glazing up saying, Oh, if only Sophia was here, we'd figure it out. The research that they're doing is to create the dungeon vault on women. I'm sure that she is the actual problem and not all these boomers. Today's episode was pretty funny. Tino got abused as usual, but hey, y'all are saying that Tino wanted it, so I guess it's allowed. She was also training with the mask on, so I'm not sure how effective this training is going to be, but uh, maybe Tino's going to be next level, you know, by the end, and we can thank Liz for that. Liz is a maniac, but we knew that. She's very cute sometimes, but she's a maniacal demon most of the times, and goddamn, I thought that she was being so utterly hostile for someone just simply looking at us, but no, it was literally a spot. They're tracking us right now. Who sent us to be tracked? Maybe, you know, the Akashic people? I I'm not completely sure, but there's some funny moments mixed in there. And then the bald dude, Mr. Gark? Gark guy? 
He's pretty fucking strong. Level 7 dude, he's kind of fallen off because he's now, you know, not on duty. He's like off duty doing paperwork jobs. So maybe he'll be returning to the front line soon. And then the information that uh, there's a bunch of other Strange Reef members, right? They're all at the Night Palace. That's the incredibly strong level 7 treasure vault that they've cleared. And I guess Liz has shown up fast because, you know, she's fast as fuck. And other members should slowly... You know, come back. And the slime right now... I mean, if we're supposed to listen to the logic of the slime thing was never opened and it was always in the vault and we've never opened it within the vault, the only thing that I can really think of was that it got leaked out when we were flying really fast. Exactly where did it get leaked? I'm not sure. Maybe it's in the wolf dungeon? Maybe. Maybe it's somewhere else entirely, but a threat of a slime that could destroy an entire nation. To the, like, it's literally got banned. And Kai is like, yeah, I, I, I don't know. I, 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 uh, I'm just going to act like it doesn't exist. And if everything goes to shit, we can just run away, Liz. That's it from me. If you're still here, though, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.